I'm Karen Jones. I'm the CEO and founder of City Wealth, which has many products and services, of which are our networking clubs. One of the things we've learned throughout the pandemic is that business development has become quite difficult. Although we can all connect on the Zoom or Microsoft Teams, actually just having a chat with someone which is quite relaxed and enables that pub style or lounge style conversation is quite difficult. We have many networking groups at City Wealth and they've proven to be a godsend to people during the pandemic. A chance to connect, for us to send home catering, which has included cocktails and snacks, cakes uh, to any location in the world. And it gives people a chance to just kick, kick their shoes off, have a good work discussion, but also reconnect with human beings. So discussing those, uh, we have a tomorrow club and what is the purpose of that? It was for people in their first, perhaps second job who enter the industry. They come in, they're expected to get their skills up to speed. Often that's a difficult, mysterious place to be and they need to find connections very quickly. What does our tomorrow club do? It enables people at a similar age group and similar problematic point to come in and make those connections with other organisations at their own level. So somebody at McFarlane's can meet someone at Deloitte or somebody at Zedra or Dixon Wilson. It's for small and big organisations. The idea is that it's a learning curve. In each of our groups, usually when it is not pandemic, but we still replicate this in the digital world, we invite our members, and there is a paid subscription which you can access on the website, to attend an event with roughly 35 to 45 individuals each quarter to discuss industry uh, topics, but also to partake in speed networking and to hear a mentor from the industry. Mentors in the past have included people like Keith Schilling at Schillings who is renowned for his advice to ultra high net worths on reputation. The group would be two hours long, a welcome reception and then an organisation of each of the members split between buy side and sell side. So if you're an intermediary, a lawyer or an accountant, you would sit on one side of a table. If you're a bank or a trust company, in effect a service organisation, you would sit on the opposite side. The idea of this configuration is, in essence, you shouldn't be talking to competitors, but you should be talking to people who will definitely refer you work, deals, ultra high net worth clients, or people who can be friends and also give you work. The idea of the networking club is that you will spend 20 to 30 minutes doing an elevator pitch with each person that you sit with and we will manage that and then move people around the room to enable 20 or 30 very solid good contacts to be met on the night but perhaps two or three cards of people you really need to talk to to be consolidated by the end of the evening or the end of the day to be taken back for you or your members to follow up with. The concept of meeting over four sessions during the year enables contacts that could have been dropped uh, for no other reason than the schedules were very busy, children at home, other commitments made picking up these connections difficult. It just jogs the memory at the next event to enable that connection to progress and pieces of work to also progress. We know by many surveys that we've done with the industry and with our members that there are very solid work connections flowing through the clubs and many solid relationships of people who've joined at junior level up to now partner or director level have been forged at our clubs and have brought millions and billions possibly to the table to the industry. City Wealth also has a WP club which is Wealth Professionals and this club is designed to help people who have been in their job for more than five to ten years possibly longer to actually connect and reconnect with peers and say hey what's going on have you had any new deals? Is there something I should be doing? Are there any connections you have that I should be speaking to? And it just enables the reconnect with the industry. There is an urban myth or a legend that says 
the deals or new clients go to the last person that somebody spoke to. So I, I think that our WP Club helps facilitate the reconnection and our clubs have an, a model which is a four events per year and we encourage all of our members through the, uh, the whole year to diarise, be reminded by their secretary to attend the events because although sometimes life gets in the way, the importance of our clubs has always been the reconnection every quarter. Just say hello, even if you have nothing to say with a fellow intermediary, trustee or investment manager, talk about life, talk about new pets during the pandemic, but it allows that conversation to open up, to say, well, actually, I did need somebody to help with this, or could you help me with that? And it allows clients from our industry, and we pick clients who should be above five million, so we're high net worth and ultra high net worth clients, to help them make those connections and bring in bottom line earnings and profits for everyone in the industry to sustain jobs, connections, friendships across the world.